A warm welcome to everybody who is joining in this event today. My name is Klaus Martini and I am the chair of the IAG ZSA Service Management in Etsy. The scope of this IAG is to enable uh, operators to run their network in an automated manner without any human being involvement. Yes, that is the 10th advisory for the World Congress organized by Layer 123, and it's not the first time for ZSM to be involved in this uh, great event. It's always a good opportunity to present where we are, to present where we are going forward, and to get, get good feedback from people which are close to the community and with a great experience. Always we have good discussion on this kind of events. Yes, it is uh, a CSM activity in this session here, but it's more or less an edge today. Uh, also our uh, ISGs from NFV, MEC, and also the group INT will present their results and they discuss with their communities what should be done next in their, uh, in their areas. But as I said, this is an ISG CSM event session, and we will focus on this, this session here on this stream, what we are doing in CSM. And what are the next steps? As we started in 2018, we were 17 founding members, and I am really proud to say that the community increased over time. Now we have more than 70 parties which are contributing to the IHG from different parts of the of the industry, from the NT area, from the IT area, from the from the OSS. Uh, from bigger companies and smaller companies uh, involved. Yes, we have a great, a great uh, knowledge base in the ISG, which enable us to discuss the automation topic from different points of views. And that is really important to do so, uh, because automation, as I said in the beginning, is a key aspect for each operator around the globe in order to, <clears throat> to manage the complexity which we have in our networks because we are really that good and to make our networks more complex instead of simplifying it, but it is as it is. And it is a good thing that we are bringing new technologies to our network, but on the, on the other side, we have to enable us to, uh, to manage the complexity and that should be done uh, by the automation aspects. Right from the beginning, the correlation aspects uh, was in the DNA of this ISG. And uh, we said, okay, nobody can manage this topic alone, the automation topic end to end. We have a lot of good uh, standardization bodies and open source communities uh, in operations which are dealing with the topic from their point of view, for their domains, for their areas. But in this case, in our case, in the EMS case, the scope is definitely to look about from end to end uh, to the automation topic. We can, and that means we can't do that alone. That we have the idea that we have a collaboration with a couple of Kafka organizations, definitely with CDP as a, as a, CDP as a five. Uh, the service based management aspect is aligned with the ESM architecture, for example. Then, uh, of course, we have also a link to the ONAP folks, ONAP and um, ZSM. We have an alignment. We align the architecture, the ZSM architecture, and the ONAP architecture. We already did a POC, and another POC is in preparation. Then uh, we are discussing with TMF how we can use um, open APIs on the interfaces uh, in, uh, in ZSM, the ZSM architecture. Uh, maybe more focus on the interface between network and the BSS because I have the impression that the APIs delivered by TMF, TMF are useful on this interface. But of course, we have not only external collaboration, we have some inter inter collaboration with um, Etsy NFV and with Mac. Mac is uh, on the way to, uh, to have a closer relationship uh, because Mac. The DNA of Mac is more or less uh, the operation topics themselves, but it's only a part of the network, not from the end-to-end -end point of view. And Oli, also you see here, Oran mentioned, Oran is also a hot project in our industry. The, a, lot of, a lot of discussion around that, but how we can in, uh, deliver the disaggregation stuff to our network, for sure about the management aspect, we have to talk here as well. And uh, we are we are having we are interested in to co collaborate with Oran also. And the first connections are done. The first talks are already started. But we we have to do more in the next couple of weeks and months. Um, that means if you summarize it here, 
that CSM in the DNA, in DNA of CSM is really the cooperation with a lot of couple of, of industry foras and STOs, because I think it is a common challenge. Not, no single organization, no single uh, group can deliver the automation topic from completely alone. We need definitely strong collaboration between uh, all the groups. And then the competition in this case is definitely not useful. We have not to compete, we have to collaborate. And that is what my belief is. Okay, let me come to the agenda to explain you what is in front of us for the next couple of hours. I'm really happy to say that we uh, have great, two great speakers, senior speakers on board. That is Dr. Alex Choi, the senior vice president of Deutsche Telekom. And then also happy to invite here Dr. Xi Lin, uh, chief scientist from China Mobile and uh, the share of the TSC in the Oran community. And it gives you a clear indication that we are on the way to build a good collaboration with the Oran folks as well. And then uh, my colleagues will you introduce what we already did in, uh, in CSM about the architecture, about the end-to-end -end solution, the slicing aspect will be presented. Uh, and uh, in, in from different point of view, that is more or less the first part of our, of our meeting here. In the second part, we go more a little in details. We talk about um, automation technologies. That means uh, about closed loop and intent-based management. We like to share our view with you guys that you have an impression of what we have in the scope in our work items about these two topics, means closed loop and intent-based management. For sure, and also right from the beginning, another aspect was in the, in the discussion of uh, of CSM that was a security aspect. And uh, you will get some here some also some uh, more insights what we already did there. And then summary by the end, you will get an outlook uh, about the industry landscape, how we see that, and an outlook from a CSM point of view, what should be done next in our community. Yes, that's more or less a short introduction that you can expect in the next couple of hours. And from my point of view, I think enjoy the event, take the opportunities to ask questions, maybe critical questions as well. I'm more than happy we can give an answer to you uh, about your questions. Thank you and um, have fun. <laughs>